guys ever watch this YouTube channel called Ordinary Sausage? <laughs> um, I, I, I forget who I was watching. Um, some like streamer, gamer, guy, uh, podcaster, some, some dude. I think his name's, uh, what is his name? Charlie. Uh, but his, his like YouTube channel is like Penguin something. I don't know. Anyway, I, I was watching something where he said, I tried to make, the name of his video is, I tried to make sausage and it was a huge disaster. And I was like, make sausage and so I I watched his video and he had watched this guy's channel named Ordinary Sausage and um, he was kind of streaming while he was watching the videos and kind of not poking fun at the guy but just uh, analyzing kind of his videos and um, he said the guy kind of sounded like Peter Griffin's brother or something and he does the guy Mr. Sausage does kind of sound like Peter Griffin's brother, but because this dude brought this guy's channel up on his feed, the guy's subs jumped like amazingly. I mean, it was like crazy uh, to like up over a hundred thousand quickly from like I don't know what, and I subbed. <laughs> After, after I watched his video and then I went over and watched the guy's videos uh, that he had up at the time. And they're only about five minutes long, usually. And what he does is he takes different crap, uh, all sorts of different stuff. But originally his like videos were like he would take like KFC chicken box or he would take, uh, you know, Taco Bell or something and grind it up in a meat grinder and then put it in a sausage casing and cook it and then he would um, eat it and then he would rate it on a scale of five as to how good it was and um, so he's done all sorts of different sausages um, some of them you know I'm like okay because after he got the subscriber jump and he, he started getting some Patreon support, um, this guy started doing like viewer requests or like the, something like, and it just seemed like it started getting stupid. He's doing like um, pickle sausage where he's just taking a whole pickle and putting it in the casing and cooking it or, uh, you know, a, I forget what it was, like Skittles sausage or something, or uh, water sausage. I mean, it was just like ridiculous. Uh, I think he got a million views or something on his water sausage video. And um, he obviously didn't think it was a good idea, but he did it anyway because, he, you know, it's what the viewers were like recommending. And, uh, I liked it at first because I thought his idea was kind of original. <laughs> Excuse me. And that he was trying to do something different. But then it seemed like because of the viewership jump, he started just doing whatever people wanted. And whatever people wanted was not necessarily a good thing. <laughs> and so... You know, I recommended that he do something like meatloaf sausage with, like, scalloped potatoes and shit. And, uh, green beans or something. And just do it all up. You know. And it seems like the last couple ones he did were a little more, like, normal again. Like, grilled ribeye sausage or something. But he was just doing some crazy shit for a while. And, um... But his videos are real short, and they're kind of funny. He's a funny guy. Um, and so, I recommend Ordinary Sausage. Uh, just checking it out. You don't got to sub him. Because his videos are real short, and it's kind of funny. But, that's one of the YouTube guys I've been kind of watching. The guy puts videos up pretty regular, because they're so short. Um... 
other than that, I mean, really, as far as YouTube goes, I haven't really been thinking about doing a video because just, you know, same old, same old. And here we are in the car again. But, you know, I, I watch bit I watch Bedhead 1000. Other than that, I don't really watch a lot of video game stuff anymore. I'm still subbed to like 80 people or so, but like I said, only like three or four of them do videos. Jughead 82 still doing some videos. And I check out every time I see one come up. Uh, uh, Skip Rat Gaming I watch. Um, you know, Happy Console Gamer I still have sub. Um, Lawn Boy Post 1975 is still putting videos up and I, I still see them on my feed. I don't watch them as much as I used to. But, I don't know, I've just gotten, I've kind of gotten away from the video game scene. And a lot of it switched over to like Twitch and shit like that now. But in watching Bitheads, one of his latest videos, he was talking about how people ask him what video game channels he watches, and he basically said he doesn't watch any anymore, and that he watches stuff about people like making light bulbs and shit, and uh, tractor pulling and stuff like that. And uh, he goes, I watched, he goes, almost nonstop did I watch gaming channels for like seven or eight years. He goes, I felt like I was honing my craft and uh, I don't know why I'm telling you just go watch Bithead's video but then he's like um, he goes my knowledge is starting to slip on the subject he goes I you know I don't even know if I'm qualified to talk about games anymore is what he said which I find funny because his tagline at the end of the show is you just tuned into the greatest video game program in the history of human civilization and then he's saying that he doesn't know if he's qualified to talk about video games anymore but Bithead you know I don't tune into him to watch stuff about video games anymore um, I mean the video games are cool but he gets a lot of packages with stuff that's not even video game related. It's like music or um, <laughs> tools and shit and, uh, you know, whatever. And flashlights, all sorts of junk. And um, he, doesn't, he doesn't focus on the games. And that's, that's cool with me. I mean, I don't care. I don't tune in to him to watch video game content. I tune into him because he's a great, f funny guy. Um, I find his humor, even if it's, even if he's slightly enraged, I find it humorous. It reminds me of like a Dennis Leary or something. Um, that he's angry with his wife or his, his work or some guy at work or, or whatever, or just his situation, you know with his work schedule and and all that and he'll rant on for 20 30 minutes about uh you know going to the beach and just getting fucking sloppy and and, <laughs> and looking at the chicks in the bikinis and while his wife's over there you know chatting with her sister and and stuff like that or or uh going to her uh family's uh parties and stuff because evidently she's a got a big family and they have parties like every week you know and he's just getting drunk at every single party because you know it's the thing to do and it's just like he's he's got to be I mean I'm pretty sure he might be a little bit younger than me like a year but he's right at my age because I'm 45 I think he's like 40 and right around 45 himself so but uh you know, he talks about it, watching movies with his son, you know, who looks like he's about six, maybe maybe five. I don't know. I can't judge. <laughs> but his son came in and knocked on the door to his little uh, his fortress of solitude, his shed of solitude, in in one of the last videos. And he, he let his son in for a minute and was, and was talking to him on camera, and it was kind of cute. But, um... I don't know. I, I just tune into him because he's a great guy. I mean, and watch him. But you know, to be honest, I mean, really, there's just not a lot of 
video game and stuff I, I'm into much anymore right now. I mean, went back to playing Skyrim, started from the beginning again, got about to where I normally get to and get burned out. And guess what? I'm starting to kind of feel the fatigue. And it's like, I don't want to quit. I, I, I don't want to quit. I might need to just take a couple days off, but if I, if I switch and play something else, I don't want to give up on it again. I, I, I gotta, I gotta push through this. So, anyway, I'm almost to work. We're still working a eight-hour day, but you know, the Corona thing's still going on. We gotta take our temperatures when we get to work and wear masks and stuff around the office. And it's just, you know still going on and we had one lady in the office come down with it and so they're being extra cautious which is fine and uh, the rest of us are doing all right another lady got tested in the office but she was negative and so we're just uh, making it happen captain and uh, going to work, doing the work at home, and then going home thing pretty much, and playing some Skyrim and watching Ordinary Sausage and Bithead, <laughs> and, and I don't know a couple other guys. It's, I watch the Penguin guy. I can't remember. I think it's Penguin Zero or something. Um, but other than that, I, I don't really watch much. So, anyway, uh, thanks for coming by, folks, and we'll uh, talk to you soon. As I know, this video is kind of short, and I hope I was in frame for most of it. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?